Hello, my beautiful beauties and my wonderful lovelies. A pleasant evening to you. All right. You know, um, I'm somebody who really loves people and I believe in fairness and justice across the board. And I'm so happy for social media where we can get our voices out there, you know, so that people can can be spawned and ignited to move in promulgating fairness and justice in every area and aspect of people's lives. I'm going to talk in particular the Jamaican people and I'm going to even deduce it further to say the public sector workers, powers that be, those who govern salaries and other monies being paid out to public sector workers. Please understand it is difficult. People are depressed mentally. People are depressed emotionally. People are depressed financially. And it affects every other area of their lives. They become ill physically because they are broke. They have no money. Their pay cannot help. Years ago, a particular popular minister had said that those who are earning 500,000, I don't, I don't remember if he had said gross or net. Gross is what? Before tax, net, net is after tax, are barely scraping the average Jamaican is not even earning half that in regular jobs. And yet many were encouraged to go to school and get a good education so, so that they can earn something, you know, that's worthwhile where they can substantially take care of their basic needs. Their standard of living is poor when they go to the supermarket or the wholesale. They have to be putting back items they're tired of buying tin foods because they can't afford anything. They're tired of buying bulk products. I was very shocked to know that people are even buying squeeze of toothpaste, a, a slice of bread, a, a, a whatever of butter, or what you know, a cut of butter. I was shocked when I heard, and it's just in recent times I heard it. People are tired of having to put back and leave things in their trolley. And it's not that they're, they're going with a lot of money. We're talking about maybe they can't even spend $5,000 properly. Pay the public sector workers amply and, and satisfactorily. Pay them starting this month, November, and continuing. Give them whatever extra money is there to get retro. Gratuities, whatever it is, they're suffering powers that be. It is not right. People are broke and they're tired of being broke. They're tired of poverty and being impoverished. They're tired of the indigence. Please have some mercy and compassion. Follow me on TikTok. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Share this.